G'day guys, my name is Marty aka Cryptic Existence. This is a mosh pit game. Um, we get stuck with the douchebags that choose to leave. So it's a 3v6 hard points and um, it's a really intense game. So I hope you enjoy um, and enjoy the commentary topic. This one's different. <laughs> So guys, I was playing with one of my mates the other day and he told me a funny story about something that's gone on at work. Um, it's probably a little bit bad, but look, um, let's just say an animal uh, ended up dying in a hole he had to dig. And yeah, it was um, the way he said it and things made me really, really laugh. And I thought I'd tell you a little bit of a story about when I went on Year 9 camp. So, um, <laughs> I'm, I'm saying this now thinking, wow, that was a long time ago. But the funny thing is, probably some of my subscribers are going on their Year 9 camp soon. So, that's kind of demoralizing. But anyway, um, we had to go camping. So, the school thought, you know, if we go camping and things, that way we'll grow up to be bigger men and, and all that sort of junk. I went to an all-boys school um, here in Melbourne. So, yeah, it, um, I don't know. Maybe they were trying to make us manly men or, or something. I don't know. But anyway, we, we had to go camping and we had to do the whole tent thing, you know, dig a hole when you have to take a dump. You know, it's just terrible. Um, I'm not a fan of camping, but... You know, it was, it was still kind of fun, and, and you kind of get these funny memories from it. And my favorite one was, it's, I, I we'd gone to sleep and and things, and I was in my tent in my sleeping bag and things, and uh, I, I find it's really hard to sleep not in a bed. So I, you know, I was I was finding it a little bit tough already, and I woke up to this un godly noise where this kid was just absolutely screaming and i got no idea what was going on so far out unzip the tent unzip the sleeping bag run out to see him flailing a stick at a wombat right and wondered what the hell was going on this wombat had got into his food so this was night two of a seven night camp and this wombat had eaten this kid's food, all of it. Um, its head was in its plastic bag. It was shaking around and um, he was just hitting it with a giant stick. And that image will forever stick in my mind as probably one of the most weirdest ways you can ever wake up. Um, so I remember thinking, wow, I wonder what the hell is going on here. And he's hitting a freaking wombat. Um, <laughs> oh, to put the icing on the cake. Obviously, this kid's got his uh, his bag outside his tent, um, still undercover. But this wombat's eating all his food. And then when he finally managed to shoo it off, it ran into his tent. <laughs> at this point I remember I was absolutely pissing myself laughing I had no idea what to do other than just sit there and laugh um, at this, and there was also there was probably about 20 of us on this camp so a lot of us had already seen this and a lot of us were just sitting there in a great big circle laughing like crazy um, in the end um, I I don't recall exactly what ended up happening with the wombat. I think we kind of pushed the tent sideways so that it would run out. And, um, yeah, it ended up running away. And um, for the rest of camp, that kid was uh, scabbing off everyone's food, which is fair. That's very fair. I'm, I'm, I'm a very hardcore sort of like wog boy as well. So mum had given me more than enough food, believe you me. Um, so, yeah, he scored a lot of mine. But... Look, guys, I hope hope you enjoy the nice little random story. It took me down memory lane. Um, and look, have a look at that gameplay. Forty-five to nineteen, and it's a three v six. That was that was good fun. That was a lot of stress. So, um, if you enjoyed it, um, hit like and um, look. Have a look at the video in me in the outro as well. Um, that's a really really cool carry the um, carry the team on Captain Flag. Cheers, guys. Have a good one.